Hey everybody, welcome. My name is Julie and today I will show you how to make this. Okay, welcome. Here is a picture with all the materials you are going to be using in this project. I have found everything in craft stores as Hobby Lobby and Michaels as well as online. I will leave you some links in case you're more into online shopping. Red the goody down they saw Moga Munja say something Pony got gone now side Yo se need on get you hanging Red the goody Jamie Yo so Ah Kugon Nato Machanga J Tell me what I got to do Kurp and that a Bluetooth car I'm not a night down to I'm gonna see not in Galo I'm gonna get on some tro I'm gonna see an apple we get I'm gonna take a cocky shit Okay, so now that you can start, I have an old piece of cardboard that I shaped into a heart. You can make the shape and hammer through a piece of paper and then rip the paper off. I just prefer this way because I can see where the nails are going and the wood and I like that. Okay, be very careful in this part. I use pliers because they're very precise and have saved my fingers many times. The hammering will take you about one to one and a half hours. So just put on a TV show, another book or in that podcast and time will go by way faster. Okay, so after I'm done with the hammering, I like to clean the mark that I left with the chalk maker to make the outline and then we'll start with the string process. Okay, so I tie a knot around the tack I'm starting from and I make it really, really tight a couple of times. Then I go as straight as possible to the opposite side to make a line and just kind of hug every tack until I tie it again at the end. It's really easy and then just make it really tight and straight. Since we're doing the Colombian flag, on one of the sides, I made three divisions, one for each color. Once you tie it at the beginning, you just have to go horizontally and the string will guide the way. Make sure you make really tight knots so the string doesn't come off once you're done. Okay, so do the same for the other side. It's important that you go as much horizontal as you can with the string so it looks nice and clean. For other projects, you can go in all directions, but in this one, we'll go straight from side to side just to keep it nice and straight. After you're done with the string, get your star lever punch and make 3 to 5 stars. The one I use for this project is the smallest one I can find in this type of lever punch. I got this of course in Hobby Lobby as well as my string which is the Coche string. They have all kinds of colors. I use foam board for the stars. The paper has a sticky bag with very powerful glue that will stick to the string. Okay, for your layers, you can put whatever you want. The layers I use have also sticky pads that stick to the wood. I painted them in gold because I didn't want them black, but I love their texture. They won't come off, trust me, I have shipped those all over the country and haven't failed. Use any type of straight source to put the layers in place. You can also use a piece of painter's tape to line them up and then take it off. Craft stores also have uh, complete boards that you can stick on surfaces. But sometimes I just want specific words that they don't carry. So that's the only reason why I do it letter by letter in this video. Me, 
Okay, so here's the final product. If you love my work but don't feel like making it yourself, I will leave a link to my social media and you can message me with any string art design you would like to be made. Thank you for joining me today and happy crafting to all of you.